हेलो एवरीवन वेलकम बैक सो विदाउट एनी डिले लेट स्टार्ट द वीडियो एम थर्टीन फेज इट इज अ फिलामेंटस रोड शेप फेज एंड इट्स जिनोम इज ऑफ सिक्स पॉइंट फोर के बी एंड सिंगल स्टैंडर्ड जिनोम इट इनफैक्ट द ई कोलाई बैक्टीरिया वेन इट रेप्लीकेट सो इट रेप्लीकेशन फॉर्म इज डबल स्टैंडर्ड बट इट्स जिनोम वेन इट इज इन द हेड ऑफ द फेज इट इज you can say it is single stranded now this m13 vector these are generally used when we want to obtain the single strand copies of our dna and this you can say this m13 is a very important phase whenever we want the single stranded copies of our dna now what are the vectors which are based on this m13 phase so first example is m13 mp1 so what it is in this case like this is the m13 phase genome here the origin of replication is ori is the origin of replication so in order to make m13 mp1 what we did we ligate the lac z site into its genome and now it can be called as m13 mp1 vector means it has lac z which is a gene which code for the enzyme beta galactosidase and this gene help in the identification of वेक्टर और होस्ट विच कंटेन दिस वेक्टर सेकेंड एग्जाम्पल ऑफ वैक्टर बेस्ड ऑन एम थर्टीन इज एम थर्टीन एम पी टू वैक्टर विच इज दू कैन से एक्सटेंशन ऑफ एम थर्टीन एम पी वन इन दिस केस वी जस्ट एड और वी जस्ट यू कैन से वी बाय द इनविटर म्यूटर जेनेसिस वी जस्ट एड द रिस्ट्रिक्शन साइट फॉर द इको आर वन एंजाइम सो दिस इज नाउ कॉल्ड एज एम थर्टीन एम पी टू वैक्टर next is m13 mp7 so here in this case it is also the extension of m13 mp2 we add more restriction sites in this lac z gene and this is generally done with the help of polylinker so oh, what is polylinker polylinker is a you can say it is a nucleotide or short nucleotide sequence which contain restriction sites for many enzyme like for eco r1 bam h1 sal1 pst1 etc and this polylinker it also has sticky ends so it is it can integrate into this lac z gene and create the restriction site like here this polylinker can be incorporated into the lac z gene and ultimately it create the restriction sites or these are the sites which were in the polylinker like for eco r1 bam h1 so this is now known as m13 mp7 vector so this was about the bacteriophage its life cycle like lysogenic or lety cycle lambda phase and m13 phase and the vector which are based on the m13 and this lambda phase bacteriophage so that's all for today guys see you in the next video thank you very much